three books that discuss LGBTQ themes are off the shelves at Waukee High Schools. The school says the books are under review after parents claim they contain unsuitable content for students. As KCCI's Lauren Johnson explains, there are strong emotions on both sides of the argument. Does equity and inclusion also include incestuous relationships, child, adult, sex, and books that promote pedophilia. McClanahan is referring to a book at Waukee's Northwest High School Library titled All Boys Aren't Blue. The text describes an inappropriate sexual relationship between the young main character and his much older male cousin. That book, along with Gender Queer and Lawn Boy, have been called for a review by the Waukee School Board. All three of these titles described LGBTQ themes. Gender Queer depicted a sexually explicit cartoon one parent displayed to the board. This is also in the book. Gender Queer at Northwest High School, available for children as young as 14 years old. The district issued a statement to KCCI saying the titles have since been removed from the shelves for review. Once each book has been reviewed by the board, a recommendation will be made to the superintendent regarding whether or not it will return for students to check out. During that school board meeting Monday, one parent said any child can pick up these books that display explicit content as their covers can be misleading. These books may appear innocent. However, when you dig in, you find much, much more. Gender Queer explains the journey of a non-binary asexual teen navigating their way through their sexuality. And Lawn Boy details sexual encounters the main character has with another male character. While the controversy over these two books isn't anything new, one Iowa says they may play a vital role in self-discovery in kids and young adults. It's very disheartening because what LGBTQ students and non-LGBTQ students really need in the literature that they consume and the things that they have access to is to be able to see themselves and their peers. Moet shares it was very eye-opening for him to have access to certain materials when they were growing up. Books that chronicle the experience of LGBTQ youth can help many feel seen and valid. It's so important then to have things like shows, television, uh, books, um, magazines that show and reflect not only who you are right now, but who you will be in the future. Um, that's really, really powerful and it can save lives. Lauren Johnson reporting for KCCI 8 News. I was news leader. Waukee joins several other districts nationwide that have brought these particular books into question.